Jerusalem has 500 companies uh, working in tech today. Um, there's amazing co-working spaces and investors and international companies who want to partner and do things. So every day there's a tech event in the city. There's, it's an amazing uh, community. Jerusalem is by far the most natural place in Israel to have a biomedical startup because in a very small geographic point, what we have is a high power proficiency and a, and, and a large array of physicians, scientists, and uh, product developers or product managers, about 120 companies, place us to be the number one focus in this industry in Israel today. a part of something. You don't, you're not a loner and you have the people that will help you. They'll help you recruit and they'll help you understand how to scale and they'll help you get funding. For example, now you can see here one of the mentors, uh, he's sitting down with each startup and really guiding him hands-on. Like, like what sort of marketing do you need? Like how I can help your specific startup? The data doesn't lie. I mean, our, our numbers are, are really phenomenal. Um, there's really been an immense growth, and you can see not only in the quantity of companies, but also in the quality of the companies. We have companies like Glide, like Lytrix. Um, our crowd was um, nominated as one of the top 10 fintech companies in the world. Um, so I, I think really we're seeing um, a renaissance not only in the number, but also in the quality. Coming here, we were surrounded by entrepreneurs of all stages and all ages and all genders, keen to work, keen to do business. The first media cooperative in the world, people that have hosted us, unbelievable. Like, this thing has been waiting to explode for years and all of a sudden it's happening. Super exciting stuff. This is a place to be. In a few years, people are going to speak about what was going on now here. People are already speaking about it.